Welcome everyone to NBA Basketball on 2K Sports. With our analyst, Brent Berry of Grand Hill, this is Brian Anderson, along with reporter Allie LaForce. Allie, it's all yours. Kyrie Irving draws praise from Blazers head coach John T. Phillips, who said, quote, as somebody that played the point guard, I think Kyrie's the most skilled player that's ever played the position. His shot making is incredible, and he's a better passer than people give him credit for. He's a wizard. Brian, that says a lot. Sure does, Allie. Thank you. And checking out Brooklyn's opening lineup, it's KD at power forward and Claxton at center. Kyrie Irving out there with Ben Simmons. And it's O'Neal in at the small forward position. And for the Wizards, Avdia and Kuzma, they make up the forwards. Monte Morris is out there with Kispert. And it's Porzingis in at the center position, locking down the middle. And here in the middle of the season, these teams really coming into their own right now. They found their identity and know what they're all about, Grant. Well, oftentimes, that's what happens. I mean, these guys have had the time to gel and get to know how they like to play. And at this point, it's all about going out night after night and just executing. And the shot's good by Irving. Point, playing with a bunch of different stars throughout his career, Kyrie has learned to be effective without the ball in his hand. Morris can't hit. Brooklyn with the ball. It's a three-point game. Pass to Claxton. Irving with it. From outside the arc. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. The touch that Kyrie has from the perimeter. So lethal from that area on the floor. Morris down low. Simmons defending. Oh, denied by Durant. Outside Simmons. Pass to O'Neal. And so the ball out of bounds. Morris touched it last. Basketball. And we have to take another look at that block. That'll put some fear into the shooters. And he made sure to do it early, too. basketball and exploiting whatever holes that he's seeing right now in the defensive squad. And that was the mobile one drive. No resistance to the finish line. And he made that drive look easy, but that had a high degree of difficulty. Man, he's had three good looks at the basket and nothing to show for it. And Kevin Durant post Achilles surgery. No apparent decline. Last eight. season, the third highest scoring average of his career. I mean, incredible. Almost 30 points a game. Think about this. Two of the four times he's led the league in scoring, he did it averaging less points per game. And his efficiency, huh, good as ever. For three, Irving, that's good. Kyrie Irving's Irving. got nine. This has been just a dreadful Turn start with him defensively. Not good at all. Now a timeout called by Washington. What we're looking for the training over the last year. And it started to seem like a sinking ship. But with KD still on board, the chance to stay on He's invested so much in this team. I'm glad to see him remain in Brooklyn. For Washington, they've gone 0 for 3 from the floor to begin this one. Pass to Kispert. About two minutes gone by in the first quarter. Will it go? Kevin Durant pulls it in. I know it's early, but going 0 for 4 to start a game can make a team get a little bit tight. Here's Simmons. Here's the drive. Yes. Slam dunk by Simmons. They've shown so much energy right from the start, particularly on the offensive end. Yeah, if you walk in at any point during this game to watch five minutes of play, one team played harder. We know who that was. And that one makes him two ben for two. Simmons. He's in his rhythm. <laughs> An outstanding first quarter from the field. Just over two and a half minutes played here in the first. From 11 feet away, rebound Brooklyn. He may not be the strongest inside presence in the league, but still, he's got to convert from there. And Durant with the big finish. Well, part of the game plan was to neutralize the crowd. And guess what? 
Mission accomplished. Always a good sign of maturity and steps forward when you can take this kind of effort, focus, and concentration on the road to get a win. Here's Kispert. So that's making their last shot. It's going to Kispert. And that ends their drought. You could feel the frustration building with each miss. That massive kill heap there getting a little bit frustrating for them until that bucket. Ooh, took him no time at all to get that one. O'Neal's got his second basket of the night. So far, they're owning both ends of the floor. We'll see if they can keep this going. Like tonight, that all the hustle plays that meant so much to this team. Getting old here, seeing him make that lead pass with perfect timing. Irving, that's good. Irene, he Irving. doesn't look satisfied with the lead right now. He wants more, and he looks like he's going to get it. Pass to Kispert. Fires the three. Here's Kuzma. Oh, denied by Durant. Instinct, timing, length. KD, great D. To the wing, right side. Back to O'Neal. Puts up a three. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. All right, guys, what's your take on the hustle stats for the Nets? Yeah, I love the energy and aggressiveness I've seen from them on defense. They're really getting after it with all these blocks. Sometimes the offense can be keyed by just quick possession. So you get a steal, and you can get out in transition. They seem to be very focused on that end of the floor. And you get so caught up in the bravado of someone scoring on you and you wanting to even the score, unfortunately, he couldn't answer back. Here's Claxton. Looking at his production. Close to 12 points a game. Morris outside. And it's Irving with a rebound. Brooklyn in total control. Durant with it. Guarded now by Morris. Durant on the attack. And Durant with the big finish. You love how sudden Durant can be with that attack. Sliced up the defense. They were unprepared. Washington has gone 0 for 2 from outside. Morris for 3. They grab their own miss. Here's Porzingis. Yeah, good whistle there. Kevin Durant. First personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Wizards. He makes a first. I still think even after a few seasons that Porzingis has a focus to continue to get stronger physically. Both free throws good from Porzingis. Nine seconds left to play in the first. Oh, he muscles it in through the contact. They call the foul and he's on his way to the line. Good execution. They're getting some short-range looks here. And that one misses. Here's Goodwin from deep. Ooh, he released it in time, but it's off the mark. Kyrie Irving has been on display for the Brooklyn Nets. He made a big impact, scoring 12 points in the quarter. We'll be right back with you shortly. TC family, you're with you. And if you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but plenty of time left for a comeback. Boy, the Nets have been rolling along, haven't they? <laughs> on the front foot, really right off the tip. They've been ruthless offensively. Well, just taking it right at the opposition and the other team right now. No answers and no way to slow them down. They've got Daniel Gafford. Will Barton is out there with Davis. And it's Gill in the power forward. That's the group for Washington right now. Oh, Simmons with the block. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they rebounded the ball tremendously well. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. Thanks a lot. Well, Brian, the Wizards have been aggressively reshaping their roster. What they haven't done is tear it down and start a rebuild. That's often those popular route for teams stuck in the middle, but the Wizards seem to be hoping they can catch lightning in a bottle. Back to you. There's no appetite for the restart on That kind of looks like a predictable shot, one that they want. The defense has to prevent the ball from getting into that sweet spot. And that replay showed how sensational that drive truly was. <laughs> and with a drive like that, you have to ignore the scoreboard and just appreciate the energy he's still playing with. Here's O'Neal. Yes. And that's Simmons with the assist. The assist. Simmons has got four assists now tonight. Well, you know it takes courage to draw charges. They still have a blocking foul. You think more of those should be no calls, Grant? 
You know, B.A., courage is just the right word. If you're willing to step in there and sacrifice your body for the sake of the team, you know what? If you don't give them a charge, I'd prefer the no call. I like that idea. And the Nets making a change here. Harris is checked in. Davis with it, picked up by Simmons. And it's Gafford missing. Despite the miss, those are the kind of looks coaches hope to create. O'Neal on the wing. And again, Brooklyn yes, with the oh, triple. Yeah. The pass first nature of Simmons. Fantastic job scanning the floor and finding the open teammate. Martin outside. From seven feet, connects the jumper drop. Martin, Martin's got his first two points. Got to talk on defense that left him all alone. Oh, and last summer, Ben Simmons had surgery on a herniated disc. Ben Simmons. I'm not a back expert. You know, I'm more of an ankle guy, but hard to be effective when that area is just not right. They've been the more boys team tonight, and the score reflects that. Yeah, just really pouring it on right now, trying to take away the opposition's motivation. To keep the yeah, yeah, yeah. Score. <laughs> you could just see how in sync they were there. That's what it takes to pull that off. And last season, Ben Simmons caught some flack for not suiting up in the playoffs. Grant, you think his surgery quieted those voices a little? You know, I think it did a little bit. But, you know, at this point, it's going to come down to his performance on the court. He does have something to prove. It'll be interesting to see what he does. And it's Kevin Durant with the foul. That'll be a second foul of the game. Now, Kuzma, he's checked in for Davis. Sharp, he's checked in for Brooklyn. Curry comes in for Mills. with the ball. Now guarded by Harris. Kuzma. That's good. So much. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Here's Durant. Yes, it's good. Durant's got six. And just executing at a high level. I mean, taking what the defense allows and putting in the work. Basketball IQ is something that gets yeah. talked about. Importance to a team showing up here, running plays that turn into scores. Durant, the pass to Harris. And that comes off the assist Yo. by Durant. Harris has got his second bucket on the night. They've been pretty lax with their perimeter defense, giving up a lot of three pointers. Kuzma outside. Second quarter. Two minutes. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Kuzma's got four points now in the quarter. Their defense just falls apart once the ball goes inside. And there's a minute 45 left to play in the first half. Pass to Sharp. The three, Durant. And the Nets, another three. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Here's Gill. He gets it in there. And the man has now 10 straight points in the man. I'm not sure what's happened to their defense. It's Simmons for the drive. Oh, oh and the jam by Simmons. Oh, my. Big Ben showing us how it's done. Now another view of that incredible mobile one drive. Oh, big time drive and finish. Showing a little artistry on that take. I could watch moves like that all day. Now here's Gafford. He's off on the layup. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. Another shot. The shot, no good. Ooh, Durant with some nice D. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. Harris' so, shot is good. In today's game, you can never afford to get beat in the three-point battle. Here's Goodwin. Offensive rebound. Gafford. to Gill. The putback. Over Durant. And misses it off the right side of the rim. Simmons against Kuzma. And here's Durant. Out to the right wing. And here's Harris outside. Oh, and he just knocked down the buzzer beater. Just nails the three. Wait 
Affair. It's the Nets just dominating this one. And we'll be right back after halftime to get the third quarter underway. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello again, folks. Ernie Johnson here with Kenny the Jet Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. It's the NBA on 2K Sports, and let's talk the first half. It's Brooklyn out in front at the half. They are completely in control of the game, leading by a massive amount. Kenny, what's your viewpoint? Well, it comes down to confidence. From the open and tip, these guys had that swag. They had the attitude that you can't beat us. We can only beat ourselves. And over to Shaq now. First of all, where's the intensity on this? You think when a team is talking like this, at least try to put it down. Giving up open looks, let the league get bigger and bigger and bigger. Thanks for joining us, folks. We're now just a few minutes away from the start of the third quarter. shooting a low 30% from the floor. So on the floor for Brooklyn, it's KD at power forward and Claxton at center. Joe Harris out there with Kyrie Irving. And it's O'Neal in at the three. And as it goes out of bounds, out of bounds. Washington able to keep possession. Almost had the steal. You have to love the pressure defense. Yeah, pestering right now, and that's going to pay some dividends. At some point, there's going to be a turnover. And a second look at that rejection, taking no prisoners on defense there. Oh, amazing indeed. And getting stops like that only encourages them to keep attacking on the offensive end. Harris has gotten all four of his three-pointers to fall so far. Here's Abdiya. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. It'll go on Joe Harris. And it's 6-9. Denny Abdiya with great size for a wing grant. That yeah, be a for the Wizards. You combine that with his motor, too. I mean, he's already an excellent defender. Who's the versatility to cover inside and out? That's also good. So he hits both free throws. And so it's Brooklyn with it. Here's Durant. And he drains it. A solid five for six now. They're really dictating the tempo on both ends of the court. You love it. Yeah, the other team, a big concern here. They're trailing, and the lead seems to be growing. Outstanding dribble drive. And that replay was brought to you by Mobile One. And this is exactly what you'd love to see. A big, not letting up, keep on applying pressure to their defense. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. Irving for three. And the Nets, another three. Exactly what every offense needs. Shooters who can force the defense to extend. Oh, there's no doubt he's a legitimate threat from downtown, and he's demonstrating that in this game. Oh, stolen by Harris. And now the Nets on the break, and Irving gets it to go. Guys, he can't miss. I swear, he was trying to miss that. He did not miss. That means he can't miss. Here's Kispert. Pass to Kuzma. And a nice finish on the layup. Kuzma's got Ooh. six. A great move. I mean, the defense has no response. Well, just ripping through right there as he, he finds the open spot and gets right through there. High oh, basketball Harris. IQ play. <laughs> I just love the ball move. Harris has gone five for five shooting here tonight. Here's Apia. He tries for three. Flaxen with the rebound. Irving against Morris. The three is up. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. When you let a team knock down that many threes, you know you're likely to be on the wrong side of a run. Pass to Kispert. Up top, Morris. Optia from outside. Durant pulls it in. Durant's got rebound number eight now. Yeah, they're going to try to search out for somebody that's got a hot hand right now. One of four. 
to start the half. But they're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Now Porzingis over Irving. And again, Washington, no good. And right now, they're plus eight in the rebounding category. That's all. Oh, so what are we with? Davis, he's checked in for Washington. T.J. Warren, he's checked in for Brooklyn. Sumner comes in for Harris. Washington has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Great positioning on the back. Porzingis now playing with passion, engaged on the offensive glass. Sumner with a drive. And down it goes. Jam that one home. Everything is dropping for them. Just a terrific third period. <laughs> with the confidence growing, that's one thing, but they seem to be getting more intense, and that's helping the quality of their play here. So it's Washington now. After the basket by Brooklyn. And that was good. Porzingis. That's tough for the defense. Porzingis inside. I don't know who defensively is going to get to him. Sumner on the wing. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Boston's commissioner Silver took over. Granted, it seems the league's dress code is now leaving more, let's say, uh, wiggle room. You good with that? Yeah, a lot of wiggle room. At least compared to when I played, when it was more of a business casual environment. But I think it's great. Let the players be themselves. Let them be authentic. And I think in a weird kind of way, it endears these players to the fans at home watching on TV. Like a bunch of runaway models. Oh, Not before and after every game. No question. No question. Here's Irving. Following the bucket by the Wizards. Pass to Warren. Fires the three. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. Their strategy has been pretty simple here in the second half. Attack from three-point range. Maybe trying to find a little bit more space and ball movement to get guys open. Yeah, that's one way to get back into this game. Keep getting him the ball and let him make the shot. Yeah. Out of bounds. It's going to be Washington's ball. Here's Barton. Looking at his stats, he's putting up about seven and a half per game. Pass to Gafford. Puts it up from 12. The offensive rebound. Oh, oh wow. That'll be a move to remember. Wow. Yeah, great creativity in the air. And here's the mobile one drive. A great move to get right to the cup. Yeah, he has that fight in him. Love the aggression at the rim when they are trying to claw back into the game. Lawrence, shot is good. Man, they're having a hard time defending the triple. That's three in a row. Brooklyn foul. DJ Warren. First personal foul. Third team foul. At the line for Washington. First free throw is good. Taking two shots. Both shots good from the strike. 32 seconds left in the third. The baseline J is on the way. And the Nets tack on two more. Texas put bounce pass there perfectly timed. The Wizards have gone 6 of 13 to open up this second half. And so it looks like the Wizards will retain possession here. There's 21 seconds left in the third quarter. Intercepted! Outside Warren. Pass to Durant. Fires for three. Gafford grabs a miss. Gafford's got rebound number eight here already in the game. Here's Davis. No good. And so it's Brooklyn making this game a no contest. They poured it on early and they've never let up. The hustle they've shown on defense has been tremendous. We're coming right back. Don't go anywhere.
as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. <laughs> yeah, just shredding the defense with that feed. Zero chance to stop that. That's what great passing will do for you right there, dissecting the defense with that play. And there have been two very different performances from these teams today as we get going in quarter number four. They've got Kispert, Christoph Porzingis out there with Davis. And it's Goodwin in at the point guard position. That's the five on the floor for the Wizards. That's a big time finish. KD dunking all over the defense. Washington shooting 34% thus far in this game. Here's Goodwin. Pass to Kispert. Here's Gill. Second chance effort. That's in there. And Davis with the assist. A stronger defensive presence would have saved them two points. It didn't seem like anybody was really aware there to go and collect that rebound in the possession. Once again, an explosive highlight on the AT&T 5G slam cam. Oh, got that bucket in no time at all. And those assist numbers have always been there for Kyrie spotting an open teammate that time. Outside Davis. his three-point total from the first half. He had one before the break. And that's his first three of this half. Three-pointer. That one falls. Eight of ten. And scoring with confidence. Field goal. And breaking down some numbers here, the hustle stats for Brooklyn. Well, their D has been a major story tonight. I mean, those steals. And pressure on the ball. Clogging the passing lanes. Impressive. Well, if we add another thing to it, it's about the urgency they've played with. I mean, you look at the eyes of these guys. They're focused, wanting to get up-tempo, and that's helped them score on a fast break. Six the tray. Twelve straight points off threes. This defense is not extending very well. Here's a good one. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Well, they're playing working to perfection there, if that was their plan. And if it wasn't, maybe that should be their plan. Here's Davis, and there are the Wizards with another bucket. After a poor offensive first half, some nice adjustments made by the staff, and their shooting percentage is climbing. Oh, it's stolen. It's a one-on-one -on -one situation. Here's Porzingis. Oh, he drains it. His sixth make in nine tries so far. Not sure which clips they watched at halftime, but he has figured out how to attack the D, and they kept him in check in the first half. He's this has been their game plan here in the final period. We'll see if it continues to work out. It's one thing to have teams shoot a bunch of threes, but with this team being that hot defensively, you got to chase them away from anywhere near that line. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last watch by Durant. Washington making some changes. Carey comes in for Christoph Porzingis. And Todd subs in for Davis. Edwards, he's checked in for Brooklyn. Mills comes in for Kyrie Irving. Here's Goodwin. He's guarded by Mills. And another miss by Washington. Well, the D really getting away with one there. No one on him. And that's going to be good nine out of ten times. Beyond the arc. And the three-pointer goes. That's where he is just so effective. Patty Mills from deep, his range... Pretty much limitless, but his confidence is through the roof. Here's Kispert. Softly drops in the motor. Kispert's got four this quarter. Such a graceful move. Showing off the floater game. Here's Thomas. And the Nets, another three. Well, this is something he's working on. A good natural leader from the point guard position wants to help out by becoming a better facilitator. And let's face it, this one was never really in question. They came out with purpose and just overwhelmed the opposition. A great win for the Nets. Pretty clear who the better team was today. They dominated in just about every phase of this game, Grant. 
VA, it's almost hard to think. Oh, oh, it didn't go well for them. Their plan, their execution, everything was absolutely on point. And for the year, this will give them win number 17. That'll put a little extra meaning on their next game. No team wants to go 0 for 4 against an opponent, no matter who it is. And when you look at the game, the one thing that helped pull this team to victory was the efficiency for Kyrie Irving. This was a showcase night for his skills offensively. At the line for the Wizards. Then he drops the first. And the Nets making a change here. Sumner's checked in. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Brooklyn with the ball. To the wing on the left. And the Nets, another three! They really came in with the right mindset today. I can guarantee you their flight home will be filled with some smiles. When you step into an opposing team's arena and you can play with this type of composure, boy, that food tastes good on the way out of town. And it's down the first one. Good on the second before he makes them both. There's 47 seconds left in the final quarter. For three, Warren. And the Nets, another three. Warren. Finishing the game strong. This is how you shut the door on any hopes of a comeback. Yeah, definitely putting a stamp on this one. A very, very decisive victory for the club tonight. Here's Gill. Banked it in off the glass. open pass and then you get it there for an easy bucket for three warren nails it from three tj warren uh, tj comes in the game you're feeling like he's on an offensive roll so when he gets on the one it's an avalanche two second difference between shot and game clock down low here's todd brooklyn with the board outside mills launches it sinks it from distance this is some of what he does best. Mills can shoot from downtown. Here's Goodwin. And so it's Brooklyn easily grabbing this one. This one wasn't even close. The hometown crowd was waiting for a miracle that never came. Yeah, and this team was consistent throughout. They met every challenge, and they earned this dub. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Kyrie, what does it mean for this team getting the production off the bench that we saw tonight? It's big time. Um, you know, when you're a basketball player and you're able to make the right plays and play at a high intensity level and really come out and make an impact on the game, no matter if you're starting or coming off the bench, we've seen some special guys do that. I'm glad we came out and handled business. Um, it's a good win. This team is so unselfish. Guys, back to you. All right, Allie, good stuff there. Thanks for that. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Allie LaForce, Grant Hill, and Brent Berry, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching tonight's game. We'll see you later.